It doesn't fall. Oh my gosh. Wow. Japan's famous souffle pancakes have finally landed in Singapore. And this week on Joey Joe's, we are checking out if jiggly pancakes are worth showing your friends for. Let's go! We're at Grand Cafe and when news broke that they were coming to Singapore, oh my gosh, the pancakes went completely viral. And I can totally understand why. Like, look at the appeal. So on top, there is a dollop of butter. Here at Graham, they make their butter and their whipping cream, as well as the maple syrup in-house to ensure the quality. The texture is a lot like Costella cake but without the eggy flavour. It's very, very, very airy, very fluffy. The butter is very unique. It's very light and it's slightly salty, but it doesn't have a very strong buttery flavour that will overwhelm the taste of the pancakes. So the whipping cream as well. It's creamy but not too rich that will make you kind of sick. If you're thinking of making this yourself at home, it won't be that easy because the pancakes are actually slow cooked over low heat and whipped full of air in order to achieve this kind of fluffy texture and consistency. The toast is an option for people who don't really enjoy pancakes. Lightly toasted. There's banana here as well. It's a pairing that cannot go wrong. This is the chili bean pancake. I was not expecting this place to have a non-dessert option. So I was pleasantly surprised. It's made of minced beef as well as a chicken sausage. I find that the pancake here is different from the premium pancake. It has more of a chewy texture. The pancake tastes like the one you have with the dorayaki. It's our Ting Tong favourite snack. So now I'm going to try the last dish for today, the rich tiramisu pancake. Compared to the premium pancakes, you can see it's slightly flatter. There's cream in between the pancakes. And I guess this one is for people who really enjoy coffee or chocolate. This one has a much stronger flavour compared to the premium one. As a fan of coffee, I really enjoy this. I think I'll cheer a friend who's a foodie to come down to Graham Cafe to give it a try. Especially because they're quite Instagram worthy. It's like food porn, right? And all the dishes are actually under $20. So it's quite affordable, especially if you're going to share a dessert with a friend. As you usually will, right? No, a foodie friend? Tag his or her name in the comments down below. For more of Joey Joe's, do give us a thumbs up and follow us at Asia One Call. Bye!